guys, this is Pretty Princess 100, and welcome to another episode of Final Fantasy IX. In the last episode, we um ran into Princess Garnet, and also we ran into Zorn and Thorn, and we got to see Steiner, which is another character of ours, and we are now getting chased by Steiner and a Pluto Knight which I believe is blank. So, in this episode, we are going to continue on to the story and find out what's going on. So, let's go ahead and continue. Hey, it's the Pluto Knight. Is this really blank? Come on, blank. That has to be you, right? It's blank. I knew it. I knew it was blank. Of course she's not. He's disguised as a knight. He didn't even notice. <laughs> so we are actually getting ready to fight Steiner. Interesting. Wonder if he has anything good on him. Guess we'll find out. A leather hat. Oh, how is that a miss? Hmm. A silk shirt. Hey, that's a good that's a good item. Let's see if he has anything else on him. He doesn't have anything else, so we'll just go ahead and blur out the attack. Steiner, you might as well give up. Yep, we beat ya. Uh oh. Um, um, I don't think that's a good idea. Oh, Steiner, I think... Oh, he did it. I told you it wasn't a good idea. Yeah, yeah. Now look, you you say you hate Aquaps and look what you did. Look at that. It's just Oh my god, there's an Aquap in front of the screen. Get away. Get away, you bug. Oh, we're going back to King Leo. I wonder what's up. <gasps> Marcus! Oh no! Do I have it too zoomed out too close? Apparently I do. She might believe she doubt love thee. Never shall I see her marry a peasant such as thee. He is not a peasant. Oh. He's going to be executed. No. Get on number two. On number two. What? One of those elevator things? Oh, it's an elevator. Oh, that's so sweet. Where is it bringing it up to? Oh, up there. Uh-oh, now we're in doo-doo. She's studying drama. So according to this, Baku is saying that Bronn's still watching, so she don't even know anything that's going on. She's probably thinking, oh, there's a certain knight out on the uh, board. So she don't even know that Steiner is actually right there 
seriously and acting goofy? Aww. Yeah, you should give them thy blessing. Never, but they're so cute together. Lord on oh, Jesus. Too many of them run away. <laughs> Scared of cats. She is a good actor. Because it's fake. It's just a play. Huh. Look at Steiner. Actually falling for it. Oh. Oh. So basically this love story is almost like Romeo and Juliet. Because the girl dies, and then next thing you know, the guy dies. So it's the same way with almost Romeo and Juliet. So. Yeah, I'm surprised you guys haven't got caught yet. Oh! Speak of the devil. Vivi, hey, don't leave him behind. God, what a bunch of idiots. Oh boy. Now we're Major Doo Doo. Hey, so you guys really suck. Like, literally. You Knights of Blues suck. Oh, okay, now we're Double Doo Doo. She is coming with us. She's leaving the castle. Does that explain your question, Steiner? What orders? You guys are doing nothing but running around trying to chase a black mage and bailing at it. Come. Stubborn, yeah. He, Steiner, you're freaking stubborn. I sir rest a lot. <laughs> no, she don't have to wait. She is going. Oh look at Vivi. He's so cute. Oh We gotta beat your butt again and this time with your two lame old piece of crap nights nice Pluto's. Jeez. Take out these stupid knights of Pluto's. What date? Oh, now you're by yourself. Poor Steiner. How did he get hit by his by the princess? Is that a miss? That can't be a miss. No way. Oh, that one's done with. Thanks, Vivi. Oh, only a flush. Oh. Poor Steiner. Oh, looks like we're in the ship and we're heading on out. 
Oh, well, looks like we're going to be running into another cutscene, guys, so I'm going to see you guys after that. Guys, Queen Brong is not too happy that we're kidnapping the princess. So she sends a damn bomb at us. And we have to fight Steiner again. But this is a time um, battle. Come on, when is this time battle going to be over? I'm in just like quiet during this because it's just a time battle. Oh, we're, it's almost done. Well, then turn around, dumbass, and take a look at yourself. Alright, guys, so it's going to go into another cutscene. So I will get to see you guys after it. Why would Queen Moran send a bomb out and try to kill Garn and try to kill the people? I mean, heck, even her daughter was on the ship. Like, seriously. But as you guys can see, the ship is going to crash, and that probably means another short cutscene. So I'll see you guys after that.
Well, wherever we landed looks really dangerous. No, of course she's not. Oh, those two clowns again. Experiment. I wonder what she's talking about experiment guys but anyway guys we have no idea where we're at we're in some kind of forest and as you can see Zidane is waking up from his unconsciousness and is wondering where everybody's at and wondering where we're at but as you can see oh oh my lord oh dear So apparently we're in some kind of forest. And just what? Huh? Nobody's ever made it out of here alive. Don't scare me, Senna. Okay. So it looks like we're in our next area we need to be at. But we still don't know what it's called. Now see, we wouldn't have crashed if it wasn't for Dan Baron. Fat, ugly queen. Uh-oh. Oh, don't say that. Oh, no. Oh, no. Garnet's missing, guys. What are we going to do? So many freaking dialogues. We're already past our time, guys. Oh, damn ATE stuff. Stupid Moogle's going to teach me about that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I really don't want to. The Forest Keeper. Hmm. There's Garnet and Vivi. What the heck? Well, apparently something is going on that we don't know what's going on. But <laughs> I guess we won't find out until the next episode, guys. Because it's already past our time and plus... I'm getting very tired and I have church in the morning. So we won't we probably won't have another episode until tomorrow. Um but anyway guys, I hope you guys liked this video and if you did, press that smash that like button and also don't forget to subscribe. This is Pretty Princess 100 out. Catch you guys later. Goodbye.